Beach and Beyond. Agents and editors. Find the craft of writing. Today I want to start this episode pronounced by author. Blake. The party for just been the last 30 years of my life. And you know... It- Hi y'all, I decided I was going to vlog today. It's just a nice little summer day in my life, almost like a summer routine. This morning was so nice. I pretty much always work out in the mornings, but I'm working out tonight. So I had a nice like chill morning and I read my book and drank my coffee from the pool. Like it was everything. Um, I'm making my AG1 currently. So today is just kind of like a summer day in my life, like routine. I've been a lot more relaxed as far as like waking up super early and whatnot and also just like my day-to-day routine but i'm still keeping like my healthy habits in you know like ag1 things like that um but speaking of ag1 they are sponsoring today's vlog which is so exciting because i have been a paying customer of ag1 for probably like two years now i'm their biggest fan i love the individual packets i will just grab like however many days that i'm traveling i'll grab them and throw them in my carry-on or whatnot and i Love AG1. I also like really like the taste. But you guys have seen me drink this like so many times. It's a very easy little morning ritual. And I love that I'm able to keep the routine on the go, especially because I travel so much with the packets. It's great for nutrient replenishment, which is amazing, especially for me right now. I feel like this summer I'm just constantly run down, as you guys know. It's also really helpful for focus and energy. It's great for gut health and stress and mood balance, which is huge. It's also great for immune health. AG1 also has the highest quality ingredients and the strictest manufacturing standards. I notice such a difference. I feel like I have really bad, like, brain fog and I just get sluggish and I'm tired and whatever and like AG1 really helps with that. There's daily support for energy and immune system, gut health and digestion, liver function, hormone function, brain and neural function, body's normal detox process, blood sugar levels already within normal range. AG1 is comprehensive and convenient daily nutrition with 75 vitamins, minerals and whole food source ingredients made just for about everybody. It's such an easy daily habit and you get so much out of it. Go to drinkag1.com slash Kenzie Elizabeth to get started on your order. AG1 is going to give my community a free one year supply of AG vitamin D3 plus K2 and five AG1 travel packs with your first purchase. Thanks to AG1 for sponsoring today's video. I genuinely love AG1. I've been drinking it for so long, way before they were a sponsor, okay? So I have that down below. Check it out, it's great. So I need to take Coco to her rehab and acupuncture appointment. I cannot believe I'm still taking my dog to rehab and acupuncture appointments. Um, a little update on her. We're seeing very, very slow progress. They did sign her up for two more months of acupuncture. And we're doing it at every appointment to up it. And honestly, like I'm really used to her life um, not using her back legs, which is sad, um, and her wheelchair. And she's happy. Like She acts like her normal self. I don't notice any difference in her mood or anything like that. So, we're gonna try these two months and then we'll reevaluate. I mean, I feel like at this point, if there's no progress made, then Coco's just gonna be a girl on wheels. And that's okay because she likes her wheels and she's having a good life and she's happy. It'd be different if she was like miserable and like just not doing well, but she is really truly happy. So, that's that. I need to go do that. Um, I have a lot of editing, a lot of work to do. I shot something very exciting last night, so I need to, you know, get some stuff done, I need to edit. I would like to go to Home Depot. We got stain for the deck. I'm going to Soul Cycle tonight. Like we got a lot. We got a lot going. We're leaving Coconut's appointment, and I am so hungry. I ordered a salad to be at the house. I'm always timing my DoorDash to when I'm getting home. Appointment went way longer, and I have a lot of work that I wanted to do this afternoon. So I'm gonna make my salad, and make coffee, and then just get to work. Sorry, we're back in the same location, but I have the best package. Califia Farms sent over another box. I don't know how I feel about my Califia Farms. Oh, this is exciting. Limited edition pumpkin spice. This literally makes me want to cry. We are getting so close. Caramel apple crumble. Guys, I could cry. And then, of course, they give me some cookie butter, which is my favorite, if you guys didn't know. Wow. Getting fall creamers. That just makes me so happy. And then my favorite iced coffee, which... I, it's so hard to find just this iced coffee like it sprouts they have like the other ones that are cold brews but not the iced coffee and this is my favorite so anyways um thank you califia farms for literally just making my deck i'm about to get to work i ordered the strawberry salad from mendocino farms which is my favorite place for lunch and then i also got a cookie 
So it looks fabulous. I'm just gonna eat this and work for the next couple of hours. Set up the room, it's feeling cozy. Can I just get a venti mango dragon fruit refresher? Uh, water is good. I went to Home Depot. I couldn't decide between the coolers because they only had one of the coolers that I was interested in. And I can't decide if I want like all white metal, if I'll get bored of white or if the wood one is the vibe, but there's so much wood happening. I just can't decide. Um, the stain was overwhelming to me. So then I just let that, we'll, we'll figure that out in a couple days. Um, but I have like an hour in between now and some cycle and I'm getting a Starbucks refresher. I've really stopped drinking Starbucks besides I'm into these refreshers again. So grab one. Okay. Got my little refresher. Sometimes these just really hit. Okay, I just got out of my Soul Cycle class. It's like 7.15. It was a Hillary Dot versus Lindsay Lohan versus Paris Hilton theme. So it was so good, it like unlocked so many memories. I'm heading home. I ended up reading in my car, which I've been doing actually recently, um, especially with Rebecca Yara's books. But I ended up reading in my car and I'm getting close to finishing my book that I'm reading right now and it's so good. I just love Rebecca Yara's, it's my fourth book of hers and they've pretty much all been like four to five stars, like so good. So I'm gonna go home shower and get in bed very early so I can just read. Like that's what I'm, that's what I'm looking to do. I know no one's surprised. This has improved and enhanced my digestive. I jumped in the shower. I avoid washing my hair at all costs. I'm working on my hair health and washing it once a week has definitely helped her. Some, really, it's like two times a week, just depending. Um, so when I'm working out, what I end up doing, well, by the way, actually, I'm gonna tan my face as I'm telling you guys this. So I've been using this salty face tanning water because Macy used it and it looks so good, so I got it. And sometimes it's like the perfect tan on my face, like the perfect amount of, co of color, it's just amazing. And then other days I wake up and it like doesn't do anything. So I'm assuming it's like whatever skincare I'm putting on underneath, but I just put like a little oil. You're just supposed to do your skincare and then put it on on top. Um, I have the medium to dark. To use apply to a clean place as well as a final step as your skincare routine. And I don't put like much else under, I just put like one serum on. So, anyways, I'm gonna spray it all over. And then I take the little brush and I kind of just pat it in and dry it. So, anyways, when I'm working out, especially like a heated class, today was just soul cycle, so it's like the easier kind of a workout. But I like throw my hair on top in a bun and I like twist it into a bun. And then I'll typically redo that bun throughout class like one or two times, depending on like how high, it, like sometimes a lot of times have to do more just because I'm moving around so much. So it's not really getting creased because it's not in the like ponytail or whatever long enough. And I always do a bun, I don't do like just a strict ponytail. And I always use like something like this. I don't use like just like an actual like ponytail ponytail. I like to use like the kitsch stuff um, or whatever brand it is. And I take my towel and I put it under my sports bra so like nothing from like my body like sweat isn't getting on my hair from there uh, Then I keep it up until I get home and at that point my hair it's like kind of gross but like has dried and then I'm good to go But it really is an art. It took me a long time to perfect it um, But when you get blowouts at the time or when you just have extensions you understand just like a hair care day takes so long like it takes forever to dry my hair alone. Um, the workout was tough, but that's just because it was at night. Like if I do it in the morning, I just have a lot more energy. And at night, I'm just like sluggish. And I like to be at home by six. I don't even wanna be out working out. I like to be home, cozy, having a night. I don't need to be working out. I need to be home. So anyways, I'm glad I did it, but I normally don't. Anyways, on my matching pajama set. This is from Kip Sleepwear. They embroidered this on, like how cute, right? Um, and I just door dashed uh, McAllister's and we're gonna get to reading guys. This is what we must happen. Okay, so I have my McAllister's 
and then I have my hot take dough. I have the whole bag in here, but there's only one left. I just, that's how I transported it here. I love this cookie dough. It's not like a better for you quote cookie dough. It's just cookie dough, but it's high quality ingredients. They're Texas based and I just love, love this cookie dough. It's unbelievable. I never bake them, to be honest, I only eat the cookie dough, but I'm sure they're great if you bake them too. So anyways, Texas based, if you guys are interested, highly recommend. I need to tell you guys what the name of the book is that I was talking about because I can never remember the name of the book that I'm reading. It's called The Last Letter by Rebecca Yaros. Um, and I'm just gonna spend the rest of the night reading this book and then hopefully go to bed early. So that is it, honestly, from like my summer routine vlog. It's not much. I, I do as little as possible because it's so hot. Oh, another thing that I've been thinking about a lot lately, like I just feel like I'm kind of like my flop era. And I kind of am. Like if I'm being honest, I kind of am. Um, just like work stuff, it doesn't matter how hard I try, it's just like nothing's hitting. And here's the thing, like summer is my flop era and I forgot that until today. I was like, wait, this happens every year literally every year because it's so hot and I'm so miserable and I just hate the season. I try my best, I really do, but when it's like 113 degrees outside, it's kind of it's kind of hard to do, you know? So it's okay because fall is approaching and I'm gonna be back and my fall vlogs are the best vlogs ever. They're amazing once, you know, I'm in my season. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this vlog still. I love you guys so much. Subscribe if you're here and I'll talk to you soon. Bye. And like, it's like, this is what I'm used to. So now that he's like sharing it and millions of people are like liking it too. It's just like, it's awesome. Oh, it's so funny. He's so funny. I just love y'all's friendship because it does seem just so like pure and genuine. Yeah. And it reminds you of like your, like my, it reminds me of my best friends. Yeah. And it's just, I don't know, there's something about it. And I love the laugh track. I think it like makes the video better. You yeah. Know? Yeah. I mean, it's, it's like, like I said, like, Jules and I like have been there for him and he's been there for us like through whatever so it, it is very like genuine and like we love him and like he loves us and it's so funny like one of his like fan accounts made like an edit of us the other day like Brett and Jake and 